So this is the new Limbs and Things catheterization trainer. Um, it comes in male and female. And there is an option for doing a suprapubic catheterization, both pre-ported, so exchange of suprapubic catheter. Or there's another module that we don't have here for doing ultrasound guided primary suprapubic catheterization. You may notice that this looks a little bit similar to the, the, the previous model, which is now discontinued and this one replaces it. So what's different about this one, what makes it better? Firstly, the fluid system, it's now in this kind of container that sits on a stand. You may remember the older one was hung from a frame, just to sway around a little. This sits securely in the frame here. A lot of effort has gone into making the genitalia a little bit more realistic on both the, the male and the female. Um, the male has a foreskin, which the old one did, but it's slightly, more, slightly improved, easier to attract, slightly more durable. Other functions for this are that it's see-through, so if you wanted to have it sitting to one side so you can observe what's see-through, so somebody can observe what's going yeah. on, you can do that. Also, this allows you to put it between your legs and have like a hybrid simulation. And there's an extended tube that comes from here to the water container that's behind you. So you can do live catheterization, but in a more kind of hybridized simulation. It works in exactly the same, so you can use this in exactly the same way as you would work with a patient uh, in terms of the procedural element of it. Same lubricant, same type of catheter, and just complete the procedure as you would in, um, in a patient. They are interchangeable, just... yep, so they share a set of hips. So we can take that out, and put the other one in, and allows you to exchange rubbery. And that's the, uh, the new Limbs and Things catheterization trainer that's um, available just now.